I want to show you how you can use the recurring general journal entry in Business Central to create clearing transactions that you can then allocate to other accounts and dimensions within Business Central. So this would be a good way to allocate administration costs from one dimension to one or more other dimensions. This is the recurring general journal entry right here. And I have a number of allocations I'm going to make. These are the account numbers from which the dollar amounts will be taken. Then they'll be allocated to other accounts. So I've got 11 different lines here. So for each line, what I've done is set up a dimension filter. And what I'm saying here is for department, when it equals nothing, take that dollar amount. And then I'm going to allocate it to these accounts and to these dimensions here. You can see the allocation breakdown. So what I've done is I have 11 allocations I'm making. And the allocation by dimension changes for a lot of these. So if I go down to the next one here, look at the allocations. I'm just allocating everything to this department code here. I also have the setup to recur on a monthly basis. So a report I like to use is the trial balance with spread global dimensions. This allows me to look at my trial balance and see my global dimensions in different columns. So let's take a look at that. This is the report dialog box right here. I'm going to select this dimension. This is one of my global dimensions. I'm going to report on that and I'm going to report for this time period. So let's take a look at what this report looks like now. So the expenses I'm going to allocate are many of these expenses in here. So what I want to do next is I'm going to run the recurring journal entry for two months, and then we'll see how this spreads out amongst my other dimensions. Here are the other dimensions right here. So again, I'm allocating money from a dimension code when it's blank. I'm going to allocate it to one or more of these dimensions up here. So the posting date on this is going to be November 30th. If I post it, it's going to go ahead and do all the posting. And it creates a number of transactions to clear that amount from the blank dimension to the dimensions for apartment. Let's run it one more time. Now let's look at this report again and see how it's changed. And you can now see that this total expense has now been allocated across three of the dimensions I have in my system. This is one way you can allocate in Business Central by using a clearing transaction in a recurring general journal, it'll clear out the amount in the source accounts and then move them to the target accounts. You can do this by dimension if you want to.